Hey guys, so today I want to discuss what happened after I drank chlorophyll for two weeks. Okay, so for the last two weeks, I decided to take one tablespoon of chlorophyll each day. And after I drank the tablespoon of chlorophyll, I drank bottled water because tasting the chlorophyll, I don't like it because it has a little bit of sweetness to it. And also it makes your teeth green. <laughs> so unless you want, you know, to have green teeth and walking around and you have no issue with that, you don't have to drink water right after. But I did. <laughs> um, so that's why I chose to drink water for that. And also I naturally drink water every day. But sometimes some people drink chlorophyll water where you add the tablespoon of chlorophyll to your water and some people find it easier to drink it that way. I did not. I don't like the taste of it whatsoever. So I'd rather just drink the tablespoon straight out of the bottle and not mixing it with the water. Um, so yeah, I did that. And the first thing that I noticed is that I started having regular bowel movements. So if you're suffering from constipation um, and you want to improve your digestion, then drink a tablespoon of chlorophyll because it will help you go to the bathroom. And I went great. I know, TMI, right? TMI. But some people may need help with that. So, yeah. So, I thought it was great. And the second thing that I noticed right away is that my skin has cleared up. I mean... It was awful before. I'm gonna show you guys an image of my face when I first started. I had more uh, hyperpigmentation and now I don't, which I mean, I have a little bit, but not like how it was before. It really, really cleared up my skin. It actually healed it, which is great. And it also gave me a little bit of a glow. So chlorophyll gives you a glow and it clears your skin, which is a good thing. And it's anti-aging. So you're trying to look young like me, <laughs> then uh, by all means, take out uh, your chlorophyll daily. Um, also, if you are anemic chlorophyll is a blood builder so if you are deficient in b12 and you're anemic have some chlorophyll consult with your uh, excuse me consult with your physician of course and make sure you're okay to take that supplement um and if he says he or she says that it's okay then of course take it Anyways, um, and I want to share with you the other benefits of chlorophyll um, besides the two that I noticed right away. Um, so I told you about the relieving constipation, improving your digestion, uh, it clears up your skin. Uh, if you're anemic, it can um, help relieve that. But it also reduces inflammation. So I have rheumatoid arthritis so sometimes I flare up um, but lately I haven't been flaring up so much um, which is great I keep my stress levels down because <laughs> I need to but if you are having a flare-up or if you want to decrease your inflammation or if you don't have rheumatoid arthritis and you have inflammation in your body you should take some chlorophyll and uh, see if that works for you it may work for you it may not you know everybody's different everybody's different so just make sure you consult with your physician and see you're okay with that and um, go on from there. Also, it is a detoxifier, chlorophyll. Chlorophyll detoxifies your body, which is awesome. I touched upon that already with the, the regular bowel movement uh, right away. And okay, it has anti-aging benefits. So... You want to look younger by all means have some chlorophyll and it's also a natural deodorant so if you suffer from bo 
um, take chlorophyll and see if that helps you out. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the subscribe button and subscribe. Also, if you like this, then of course you're going to click the like button. Click it, like it, love it.